welcome back to Kay and Bell Studios. I'm Kaylee. And I'm Isabella. And today we're going to be doing a review on this Crazy Aaron Mix Your Own Putty Kit. But first, remember to remember to subscribe if you like our videos. Had it, go ahead and press post notifications. Remember to give this video a big thumbs up. Thanks so much if you did this, and let's get on to the video. So this is the Crazy Aaron's Mix By Me Thinking Putty Kit. And I um, got this with my birthday money, so here it is. I'll show you what it comes with in a minute, but I've already made one, so I'll show you that too. Here's the back side, the other side. So let's crack this open. So here's the stuff that comes in the kit. Five small tins of clear putty, three color mix-ins, and three special effects color mix-ins, and a container. One placemat to mix and do anything with. And then right here we have the colored pencils. I mean like rainbow, y'all. Five extra labels in case you mess up. Because we all mess up, you know. Like. So I'm going to make one putty today. And uh, before I do that, I'm just going to show you uh, the one I already made. For an okay. example. So here's the one I already made. I called it Glacier Freeze because it looks like the... Gatorade that's called glacier, glacier Freeze Frost, you know. So here it is. This is a greenish putty, putty kind of putty, and it's um, shimmery and it's super soft. Yay! Okay, so the first thing on the placement is the color mixing zone. So how you do that is you take this out, and then here's the clear putty. Ooh. Here's the clear putty out of the tin. And uh, I was thinking of making this putty more of like a peach color. So I think for that I'm going to use yellow and red for the color mixed in. So to make this peach color, I'm experimenting with a smidge of red and a dot of yellow right here. And then we're going to mix that in you. By the way, the sizing chart is on the back of the play mat. Okay guys, so I have the yellow and the red and now I'm just going to it's like ketchup and mustard yep now I'm just going to <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to mix this up into that was the curly. into the putty okay so I gotta keep mixing and I hope this turns like a peach color or like orange at least is my goal so I'll be back to you when I'm done mixing okay guys so I'm done mixing this I did add a little bit more red and yellow until I got the color I wanted so now we're going to go over here to the special effect zone. And what I'm going to mix into it is a heap of glow putty. So it'll make it glow in the dark. Glow, glow, glow. Oh, yeah. And then uh, um, a dot of shimmer. Shimmer, shimmer, shimmer. Oh, yeah. So let's mix it in. Okay, guys. So I have it all ready to be twirled up into the putty. Ooh, this looks really cool. It looks like a candy cane. Yeah, and at the end, I'll show um, how it glows in the dark. So this will probably take a while, so again, I'll be back when it's done mixing. Okay guys, so now I am done mixing, and this looks really cool. And now we're at the final stage, which is decorating the tin. And um, I'm going to decorate this tin, and then I'm going to write what it's called. So here is the final tin result. I decided to call it peaches and cream. Yeah. Okay guys, so uh, here's the shimmer. We put shimmer putty in it to make it look really shimmery. A so, bubble. Yeah, super shimmery. And we're about to go charge it up to the light so we can show you how it glows in the dark. No, 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 no. Okay, here it is without the light. Come on Corbin, turn off the light. Yeah, so here it is. Oh. It glows in the dark, which is really cool. It glows more than person, though. Yeah. It's really brighter off camera. Yeah. Thanks. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, so you see you later. And tell me in the comments if you want to see more of me making this kit. And if you have the kit. So bye. Please. Bye.